In this video, we're going to look at installing and registering the BobCam product. Now, to install BobCam, you have to first have SolidWorks installed to uh, version 2009 or above. And the software comes with two CDs. One contains these videos, and the next CD is the installation CD that contains the software. You'll just need to simply install the software and then launch your SolidWorks. After this point, we're going to need to activate the plugin, then register the software. So you can see here I have my SolidWorks open. Now to activate the BobCam plugin, after opening SolidWorks, go to Tools, then Add-ins. Under the Add-ins menu, under Other Add-ins, you should see BobCam for SolidWorks. Now you can activate this at the startup of SolidWorks if desired and also turn it on in the individual drawing or individual time that you've launched SOLIDWORKS. We'll go ahead and choose OK. Now at this point it's going to bring up the box that says that the software is unregistered and give you a choice to run as a demo or a trial which will give you a five day full unlock when you first install and then you get an option to register online. Now, if you do not have internet access, you'll need to call one of the numbers on this box to call to manually register the software. In this case, we have internet access, so we're going to choose register online. And in this next dialog, it instructs you to look at your invoice. Now, your invoice should contain the products that you've purchased, along with the license numbers and passwords to activate the software. What you want to do is go ahead and enter your license ID and then your password. After entering the license ID and password, you click activate and wait a few moments. You should get a activation box that says that the license activation has been successful. And we click OK. The next item that will pop up is the status of your license. This will show what products are active or purchased that are on your license key, along with your customer information. We can click OK. Now we can see that the BobCam menu is loaded. And when we start a new file in SolidWorks, We now have a cam tree in our feature manager, along with a posting window, and a bobcam tab. And that concludes this video.